one breath, one drop, and one shot to get one fish. I'm Kimmy Werner, and I am a spearfisher woman. Spearfishing is an extremely selective way of hunting, and the way that I do it is I do it by free diving. So I don't use any oxygen tanks or scuba. I basically just take one breath of air, swim down to the bottom of the ocean, hang out with a spear, and when the right fish swims by, we spear it. My first introduction to spearfishing was when I was four years old. I would tag along with my dad. I didn't actually spear anything, but he would drag me on a boogie board while he went to get our dinners. That was his way of putting food on the table. And although I was just a tag along, I was just always soaking it in and enjoying it. And thanks to all those years with my dad, everything came really quickly and really naturally. And within no time, I was spearing my own dinners and eventually competing in the sport. I qualified and entered the United States National Championships. I won first place for the women's division, first place for the mixed team division, largest fish, and the Rookie of the Year award. After a few years, I just realized that I kind of wanted to just, just go back to diving for the, for the reasons I got into it. For me, it's just it's a lifestyle. It's a way to feed your family. It's a way to hang out with your friends. And, and it's just it's, it's part of the culture here. The main type of tournaments I do now are invasive species meets. And basically, Hawaii has a problem where the government, a little over 50 years ago, imported these other fish, thinking it would be a good idea for the ecosystem here, which of course it wasn't. And we take out a lot of these fish. And when, when you just kill one, you are potentially saving the 150 native fish that it would eat in that year. And so I think in my last tournament, we got 45. So just to do the math and think about how much good you're doing while being able to get that trigger happy hunter side fulfilled, it's just a win-win situation. I think it's a beautiful thing to be underwater. I feel extremely peaceful when I'm there. Oftentimes my head can be a really noisy place to live and to get underwater, I can escape that all and come home with a good dinner. It's a beautiful thing to be underwater. I feel peaceful when I'm there. A lot of times when you're excited to shoot a fish, you're gonna kind of charge after it a little more and burn a lot of your oxygen. I'm trying to, you know, twist up a spear and then...